So natural language processing, also known as NLP, is machine learning that can understand the context of a corpus, corpus being a body of related text. So NLPs enable you to analyze and interpret text within documents and email messages, interpret or contextualize spoken tokens. So for example, maybe customer sentiment analysis, whether customers happy or sad, synthesize speech. So a voice assistant, uh, assistant talking to you, automatically translate spoken or written phrases and sentences between languages, interpret spoken or written commands and determine appropriate actions. A very famous example for a voice assistant specifically or virtual assistant for Microsoft is Cortana. Uh, it uses the Bing search engine to perform tasks such as setting reminders and answering questions for the user. Uh, and if you're on a Windows 10 machine, uh, it's very easy to activate Cortana by accident. Uh, when we were talking about Azure's MLP offering, we have text and analytics. So sentiment analysis to find out what customers think, find topic, uh, topic relevant phrases using key phrase extraction, identify the language of the text with language detection, detect and categorize entities in your text with named entity recognition. For translator, we have real-time text translation, multi-language support. Uh, for speech service, we have transcribe audible speech into readable searchable texts. And then we have language understand, uh, uh, understanding, also known as Lewis, uh, natural language processing service that enables you to understand human language in your own application, website, chatbots, IoT device, and more. When we talk about conversational AI, it usually generally uses NLP. So that's where you'll see that overlap next, okay?